another beer review. I appreciate that. Getting into one from Stone Brewing Company. It's going to be their Ruination 2.0 double IPA. 8.5% ABV. I uh, just showed up not two days ago here in Calgary. And yeah, I got I got the last bottle of it. It sold out. I don't think it only had one shot so far, but yeah, it sold out. So I think they know what they're doing. Because the other one... I'm sure it was selling well here. It was at quite a few shops, but I mean, it wasn't selling out in two days. That's just ridiculous. But anyway, let this sit on the counter for a little while, probably over a half hour to warm up a bit. A little too ice cold right out of the fridge. But the new Army Man opener, pretty awesome. Like real solid metal, good stuff. Anyway. Let's get a glass of the 2.0 version. Huge fan of the regular Ruination. So, I mean, I love that beer. I bought it quite often. Um, but here we are with the new 2.0. And let's give you guys a quick look. I'll say it's a little bit of a, a hazy, cloudy appearance. Beautiful golden orange, steady carbonation, and a real thick packed uh, yeah, off white head, even like a real light cream color to it. Let's see if we can get the aroma. Oh wow. Yeah, certainly more a juicy tropical type hop aroma to it. Still got like a strong citrusy quality, orange grapefruit kind of citrus. But there's that more tropical, this melon or peach, peach apricot type of uh, stone fruits in there. Almost has like that orange juice type aroma too. It smells really juicy. There's a little bit of uh, that resinous kind of dank hop as well. But overall, just a more juicy aroma than the, the regular Ruination to me is much more dank, much more pungent. This has more of that orange juice, peach, uh, a little softer, sweeter, kind of fruity edge to it. It smells fantastic. Let's dive into it. Cheers, everybody. Really good. So good, I need to have another sip. Wow, that's really tasty. That is really damn good. Up front, it's the juice. I get this the orange, citrusy, one more bit of this peach in there as well. And it kind of just holds that flavor throughout the whole palate for me. It doesn't really fluctuate or anything like that. A little bit of that dank resin, resin as well, but more sweeter orange, grapefruit, peach, apricot. Yeah, pretty delicious. Um, I'm sure this is right along the lines of the 100 IBU. I don't know, I guarantee it's 100 plus IBU, but it doesn't seem very bitter to me. Yeah, the the finish is kind of quite juicy as well. A little dry on the finish, but really uh, like way down the palate. And it's not super dry either. It's not very bitter. 8.5% alcohol is max on the aroma and flavor, 100% for me. It's really good. I wish this didn't sell it so quick. I'm just thinking it, it's going to make an appearance at more shops eventually, but uh, enjoy by July 28th at time of reviewing this. It's, where are we? Almost two full months till the best before, so I'd say it's Still super fresh. Tastes like it is though. I 
Oh, just, is it a huge improvement over the uh, Ruination original? I don't, I can't say it is. It's just a different IPA. Regular Ruination is just, for me, it's super dank. More earthy, piney, a little bit of a citrus quality. This is much more uh, that tropical or just a fruity overtone to it. And it's not nearly as resinous or dank. And probably with that said, maybe more approachable for a lot of people as well. What's up, buddy? Um, putting a, a grade on this one. Yeah, I think it's pretty fantastic. Um, I can't remember what I gave the original. Probably going to be a higher grade at this point, but I reviewed that a long time ago. But the double IPA, or sorry, uh, Ruination 2.0 double IPA for me is still fantastic beer. I'm going to give it a 90. I think it's up there with uh, some of the better ones for sure. Really glad to get my hands on it and will be one I continue to buy here and there for sure. Anyway, and the review, I appreciate everyone joining me and checking it out. Until the next one, cheers.